Hey, thanks again for joining us here at Garage Boxing. Kevin Breen joined by Rob Ernster. Good to be here as always. Cheers, my friend. All right, let's get right to the business at hand. We've got the Ortiz Medina fight. Wow, what a fight. You also, big weekend in boxing. You had the Arthur Abraham win uh, over his opponent, and then you had uh, Juan Manuel Lopez that, uh, you know, did what he was supposed to did do. Did what he was supposed to do. Now, let's talk about Victor Ortiz and Manuel and Medina, Madonna, however you call his name. What a great fight! And we watched the fight together. Yeah, and, you it's know, a good one. it was a great fight. We had opinions. We appreciate all the feedback that we've been getting on the website or on the YouTube. And yeah, I think and it's always better. You know, we give us, we give you guys what we think, but we also like to hear what you guys think. And like to hear what everyone thinks you know it'd be good to kind of get everyone chiming in and giving their two cents and 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 their opinion on everything you know i, I think agree. that makes it a lot better for us and, and for everyone i agree and uh and and so we had opinions we're throwing them out there we appreciate through the the victor t segment here and then the other things that we're going to talk about now in the future we're going to put opinions out there give us yours we appreciate it all right victor ortiz madonna six round okay we saw it what a great fight. I mean, what do you think? I mean, it was, a, it was, it was like, awesome. It was like 20 rounds, like a 20 round fight packed in six rounds. You had a ton of knockdowns. So exciting. Uh, so exciting. Two young guys, two more or less up and comers. I think Ortiz is 22. Uh, Medina, or how do you pronounce Madonna, it? Madonna, Madonna. Medina. You know, he's 25. He's still considered a young cat. Uh, got knocked down, got up. I think he leveled Ortiz with a, a, a bigger blow. I think that's what Ortiz was a little bit glazed kind of for the rest of the fight. It's one of those things where you're like not sure if one guy has more. Who has the upper hand? Who's got the upper hand, the power, and chin, and, and no matter what happened, I mean, you know, Madonna was the winner. Um, Ortiz, you know, I mean, he's the loser, and he, some, we can talk about the issue of quitting and doing that thing, but uh, God, I just, it was an exciting fight. I, I didn't really, we were talking about this earlier, I don't, I didn't really want to see uh, Ortiz fight in in the past necessarily. He wasn't super exciting and gosh, you're like, now I just, now he's exciting to me, yeah. even though he lost. He's and, definitely still the big name. You know, you got Medina, you got a few other guys going to find in a couple of weeks, we're going to talk about them. But when you think of the junior welterweight, super lightweight, whatever division you want to call it, I think it has a few different names. Ortiz is the guy that you're going to want to see. You know, he sells the tickets. You know, I, I guess the question is going to be, who, do you want to see Ortiz in a rematch? You know, there's the rematch. There's the Katelnik uh, Amir Khan fight that's happening July 18th. That's happening. Yeah, a couple weeks. And you know, it's. Do you want to? You know. Do we, do we want to see that? Do we want to see a, a rematch? I don't think we do. I, I mean, I think maybe later on in their careers, I think you see how this, uh, and they're not making any decisions real fast, I think. You know, I definitely think Ortiz is young and he's exciting. And, uh, you know, again, there's going to be some fallout here on these fights that are coming up. We're thinking that uh, we want to hear what you think and you know, let us know. I mean, what's, yeah. what's the most exciting fight in that? What's the what's the uh, the uh, the gravity that you're feeling towards a rematch? Yeah, do you, you want to see a, a Medina see Ortiz that. rematch, or do you think you should see the the Khan and Kolenic winner, yeah. winner fight, Medina, and then? You know, maybe Ortiz gets a fight with Medina down the road after he's had a, like a that's what I want to see. Tuna fight. Yeah, that's how you're going. Yeah, yeah. I think I see it the same way, but we want to get your thoughts on that. So definitely let send us uh, some comments. Let us know. Then, let us know what you think. I mean, you know, we're excited to hear the feedback. Uh, that's uh, that's done. You know, again, we talked about the great weekend of boxing and the availability on pay per view, Showtime, HBO. Even though the Juarez uh, John fight got scratched from that Ortiz. It was, for the most part, free. The Latin Fury, you know, was decent. But uh, let's move on. I mean, we're going to recap 